Okay, so the first part for the shredder is the battery, which we need. Let me kill the office. I'm gonna and to get it, it's like one of the easy parts. All you do is go to uh, like the journey area, and on this boat right there, where I just shot off a battery part. And so what that does, it goes around the fountain every like around here, like once every like maybe 30 seconds. And it's by bang bang is a perk. But around here, in one of the fountains, like there it is. This battery part. Oh, I missed it. It's gonna be in this one next because it goes in order. Let me go through the long too. Before I die. Or let me bring him up. Okay, but basically, oh, look, there it is. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, you want to try to do this on the early round? Because, like, the higher the round, the more harder it's going to be, like this, as you guys see right now. I'm just like looking for oh, one big green. Oh, okay, I'm looking. Here it is. There you go. So basically, it's gonna but pop I out all one of those. And as you see, we got the second, the first part for the shredder, and that's the battery. Now the next part for the shredder is a little alien that symbol you like see in the bottom, right. and it's the middle part. Mm, it's one of the easier ones too. And so let's go to that right now. Okay, for the next one, for the shredder. It's gonna be like this little alien toy and personally this is the easiest one i think and yeah it's like fact wise it probably is but basically you're gonna want to get three red souvenir coins as you see by my money count and you want to go to the kepler system now the if you don't know the zombies drop the souvenir coins and you can just pick them up you can only carry one at a time but basically you're gonna we want to get that thing and to get it we need three red and it has to be in this specific one in the Kepler system. This only this one has this one has this like, toy, and then we're gonna pick it up, and that's it. That's for the sh shredder. That's the second part. So now we're just onto the last crystal shard. For the final part, for the crystal, for the shredder, uh, you're gonna need to buy this arcane core that's located around like the these those little stands around like the map. Now there's one where I bought this one in the ar arcade and you're going to need around 600 tickets. The thing I bought was 300, so I need another 300, so that's why I'm just playing this game real quick. Oh, there we go, had 300 tickets. So now you're going to come go to the arcade and go to the, like the teller desk area, the prize booth, and you can buy those gold tickets for 300. And what that does is that you're going to come to Journey and this step can be done with, uh, with the next step. Like at the same time, so it makes it easier. But basically, you're gonna need a boot, and you're gonna bring him to journey where the alligator is, and you're gonna have him like get under it, so you gotta time it correctly. And he'll crush the teeth like it just is there. So now the alligator ha is missing his top teeth, and now you can just go up to it, hold X, and the gold teeth that you bought get placed there. And in return, it like reveals a hidden trap door, and inside those containers, that's like the pack of punch ones. The uh, you need the flame to open the crystal for the shredder and to get that you basically need to kill like a bunch of zombies and like that's why we released the the little spaceships the ufos in when we went to pack a punch we hold x on the the purple jar basically you can need a bunch of trap kills by this one by the chromosphere trap and that little alien right there is gonna when he flies away and goes on the set path instead of by the trap then that's when you know look like how he is right now that's when you know you got enough trap kills <laughs> trap kills okay <laughs> but basically you're gonna want to get kills by the ufo and when you kill the zombies the, the blue like soul i guess you could say it flies into the ufo and when you get enough i think it's around like 30 or something the little like the element will drop and this one is we're doing the shredder so it's gonna be fire so now all you do is go with the gun uh, that has the arcane core and you need the arcane core to get the blue soul kills. Basically you're just going to shoot the box, that one on the very far right, and then that's the crystal shard for the shredder, oh there we go. And then yeah you need, the, you need to use the arcane core, the gun with the arcane core. And then basically you're going to take it down, you're going to go downstairs like underground and on below the map, well not below the map but like you know what I'm talking about, whatever. Okay, but basically, 
and then like under there underground <laughs> whatever <laughs> there's gonna be like the buildable area where you can build the shredder and so you can just pick it up right there whenever you want and you can place it down again so yeah picked it up that's what it looks like uh, that red one right there here's some like gameplay of it so basically it like kills the zombies <laughs> it looks pretty cool when it kills them to be honest like it like dissolves them kind of like their arms the limbs like their arms and their legs whatever and then even their heads so they're just like walking around with their bodies but yeah the discord will be coming out soon it should be <laughs> oh sorry about that uh but yeah make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already but yeah